Hi, today I'm going to show you how you can make a drop down menu on ClickUp. So, when you first log into ClickUp, you'll actually be presented with this UI instead called Home because it's your home page. Now, if you want to create a drop down menu, it needs to be inside of a task. So, before making that, make sure you also have a project and a list ready at hand so you, do, you can add a task in here, right? Now, Let's just make a new task, for example. I'm going to click on Add Task, and I'm going to call this a task with a drop-down menu, right? And you can also add tags or priority or a due date as well if you'd like, but the thing that we need to do here is to create a new field. And on create a new field, as you can see here, there's a lot of things you can add, like progress, rating, relationship, roll-up, signature, all of these fun stuff. But the one we want is called this, drop down. It's the most popular one, in fact. So just click on it, drop down. Now you need to call this field to something. So let's just call it uh, a field for drop down. You can even add an emoji here if you'd like. I'm just going to do this, something like that. You can also add a description, right? So a description I'm going to call it is this drop down is for demonstration purposes only. Purposes only. Something like that. And of course, the type will still need to be drop down. Don't uh, change it or anything. Now, this is the one that makes the drop down a drop down, which are the options. So, for example, here I'm going to add in five. And I'm going to add another option. I'm going to call it 7. And then another option, I'm going to call it 2. Right? And then another option, I'm going to call it 1. Another option, I'm going to call it 3. Another option, I'm going to call it 9. Do you see where I'm going with this? So it's just a options full of numbers, right? But as you can see here, I filled out the numbers randomly. Uh, it's not neat at all and it needs to be organized. And as you can see here, when if you're observant, you'll see that there is a sort option here. Uh, you can actually sort it yourself by hovering over and you can see there. Uh, there's like a group of circles. You can click and then drag it to reorganize some of the options here. But that's a bit uh, DTS. So let's just use automation. You can click on sort manual and then you want to click on this alphabetical A to Z and then it'll automatically sort our options just like that. So this drop down also has a lot of features that you can use. But besides that, we're happy. Let's click on this create. And as you can see here, there's a field for drop down here that we can do. Now, after that, when it's your turn, let's just click on this create task. And now you're done.